Local bus stations have been packed as a result of the president's catch and release immigration policy. Action Force Valeria Ponte joins us live in the studio to find out what bus stations are doing to accommodate these immigrants. Well, Ryan, we went to the Brownsville bus station and in the Greyhound ticket booth saw long lines of immigrants buying bus tickets. An employee told Action 4 News that they are selling 50 to 60 tickets more per day than they would normally sell. We contacted the Greyhound offices to learn what the numbers look like for the last year. While they can't disclose that information, a spokesperson says there has been an increase of bus ticket sales in the Rio Grande Valley, mainly to San Antonio, Dallas and Houston. She could not confirm the reason behind the spot and sales are always high during this time of year. We are working diligently to transport these individuals safely to their destinations without interrupting our usual operations. Um, so far we have seen no interruption of our regular operations. Uh, however, we will supply additional resources if needed. Additional resources like providing more buses and drivers to specific stations. Pedrini also says that they don't have an agreement with Border Patrol or ICE to transport these undocumented immigrants. Live in the studio, Valeria Ponte, Action 4 News.